Hey everyone, this is Hyperactive, and today I have a new how to make video. I'm gonna be telling you on how to make a Green Arrow video game. Let's go! Just like Wonder Woman and The Flash, Green Arrow has never had its own video game, but it has been in others like Injustice, Lego Batman, and DC Universe Online. For the story, I think it would be a great idea if they did an origin story. Oliver Queen is stranded on this island filled with wild animals and drug pirates. We can see the spoiled rich asshole turn into a green arrow. The story should focus on Oliver's character arc of the transformation. He doesn't have to become a badass immediately like Lara Croft did in the Tomb Raider game. The story needs to focus on surviving, developing his morals and his transformation, and of course, stopping the drug pirates. And their head leader is... Really? Uh, that's her name? <sighs> China White. That's a stupid supervillain name. What's her real name? China Wei. Uh, no! No! You don't make your supervillain name sound similar to your real name. That's like Dracula flipping his name around and just being called Alucard. Uh, whatever. Anyway, she's pretty much the drug lord that stranded Oliver on the island and after he threatened to expose her. He is stranded on the island that's coincidentally that China White is using. Overall, if they closely follow the origin story, then they should be good. Now, this is where Green Arrow can stand out from Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, or any other uh, DC superhero game. It should be a first person shooter action adventure game that has a morality system. You see, you are trapped on an island with drug cards that will kill you on sight. You have the option to kill them or not. Depending on your choices will change who Oliver is and what he can do. Like if you're going down the dark path, then you should unlock and be able to craft more lethal weapons like poison arrows, poison arrows that make people go crazy and attack others, explosive arrows, and arrows that can go through multiple enemies, and etc. etc. The heroic route will let you craft non lethal arrows like paralyzing arrows, smoke screen arrows, the boxing glove arrow, and the best one of them all, the donut arrow. It's tasty and it's dangerous. Now the game should be more focused on the stealth elements than the melee combat. Reminder, he is stuck on an island with no martial arts training. So getting up close and personal should really just be on one-on-one -on -one fights than taking on like 30 guys at once. The last gameplay mechanic that I think would be some kind of a uh, survival mechanic, like you need to eat by hunting animals down. 1022, assault in progress, over. The open world shouldn't be all available just like the Tomb Raider games. You gradually unlock more of the island as you progress and gather more gear. Unlocking new areas of the island has its own collectibles and easter eggs. It's going to be filled with dangerous animals that you can eat when you get hungry. Well that's all I got for this one. Not a very long video, don't really have much to say for a Green Arrow video game. I think it's probably be the more trickier ones to pull off since an arrow will go through people. So that's why I came up with the whole morality system. What would you guys like to see in the Green Arrow video game if they ever do it? Let me know down below and if you like hearing my thoughts and ideas, why not subscribe, like, and share. See ya!